Hey everyone, so welcome to our top 10 Thai Dragons countdown. Now of course, I wish I was a Thai Dragon, I'm not, but I'm lovely still all the same. And I, the good host to show you the top 10 without revealing who's going to be inside. Oh, here we go! In at number 10 is this green Welsh exclusive Beanie Baby and it's Dewey E. Drake. I probably pronounced that wrong as I always do. But yeah, we put this one at number 10 because we really like his colour. There are other, a purple one I think available, which you will get eventually. But at the moment we have only got this one. But he is our number 10 and he is super cute. Number nine, it is Darby. Darby's so cute. It's like it's really sort of super cute, daffy version of Darla the dragon. And as you can see, you can do some really goofy little poses with him. <laughs> but he makes a really good little pet, actually, for the dragon family. We always make him a little dog. So we like, <laughs> it's kind of cute. And uh, Darby, of course, is one of the teeny tiny ties. And for that reason, it makes it at number nine on our list. It falls to me again to introduce you to two more Welsh exclusive Beanie Boos for you to badly pronounce and it is the red ones. We've got two of these. Now we've got the clip one and the clip one is very different than the other one. As you can see it's got kind of a shiny belly and shiny wings but they've both got the same name and they are both the Welsh dragons and you've got to go with the classic red Welsh dragon because that's the one on the flag. So that's why this one's higher on our list than the green ones and again they are both called why Drieg Go or Gotch? I don't know how to pronounce it. I said people always have a go at me for my Welsh pronunciations, but they are pretty bad. And yeah, we've got two of the red ones there. But as I said, they are the classic red dragons and they're both super cute. So that's why they are in at number eight on our list. And then it is Sapphire. And Sapphire is such a gorgeous little dragon. Really soft, so cute, really shiny. Everything you could really want from a dragon, really. Sapphire, of course, is a Beanie Boo tie. And the tag says, I can blow fire. It's easy for me. And my big wings let me fly wild and free. Oh, Sapphire, that is so true. <laughs> Next up on our list, in at number six, is our equivalent of a bad boy dragon, and that is uh, Razor. And some of you guys may know him on our skits because he is actually Darla's boyfriend. Uh, he speaks like this. Uh, hey guys, uh, big thanks for putting me on this list. Uh, I knew I could make the top ten because I'm a super cool bad boy dragon. So yeah guys, that's Razor, and he is super cool because he's camouflaged. That's why we kind of make him a bad boy, because he's sort of like a camouflaged army army guy dragon. So he's really cool, and I like his sort of bright orange, sort of goldy kind of belly and wings. And his tag reads, I like to play, as you can see, but you don't know, you'll never beat me. And that's true, Razor is super at all the games, and he always wins. Uh, bye everyone. In at number five on our dragon countdown is the famous Beady Boo Cinder. Mm. Hey everyone, I'm Cinder. And Cinder is a really cute dragon. He's one of the original dragons released for Beanie Boos. And his tag reads, Let us be friends and you will see I'm the happiest when you are with me. And obviously we've got our characters with the Cinder, so we're going to bring our other characters in. So here's the usual Cinder. Hello everyone, <laughs> I'm in the top 10, <laughs> okay. <laughs> and we've also got Cinder's derpy cousin. Oh, hello everybody, I uh, know you guys would put me in the top 10 because I'm so much cooler than you Cinder. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> whatever you say derpy Cinder. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm but uh, they put me slightly higher on the list than you so that that's true you know. That's not true. Shut up. You're getting too big for your boots. I don't wear any boots. Oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> for it's Nora. Nora is so, so cute. She's so sparkly and full of rainbow and glitter. She's everything a little crazy, sort of gothic looking girl dragon should be. 
Well, maybe she's a boy. It depends on your taste. But yeah, she's got beautiful, perfectly sparkly eyes. And, and her tag reads, you'll not see me in the park because my fur is really dark. That is true, your fur is very dark and aura, but you're still super cute. In at number three is a super cute beanie baby dragon, and one of my favourite beanie baby dragons, it is Scorch! And we have the big Scorch, and we have the small Scorch. And as you can see, they're both slightly different, because the big Scorch has kind of a really soft sort of fur, and actually I think he was the first beanie to have tie-dye curly fabric. So this is the tie-dye curly fabric, apparently, and he was the first to have that, it says on the tag. But as you can see, this Scorch is slightly different. He has kind of a different kind of feeling fur. It's more like, what would you say that was, Emily? It's kind of it's like wool or something. Yeah, kind of a woolen design and this has more of a plush feel. But yeah, I think Scorch is one of the best Beanie Baby Dragons and that's why he is number three on our list. The wings are so aesthetic. The yeah, they, they, I love the feel <laughs> of the wings. They're like Halo's wings. They yeah. feel really like soft so and squidgy, but yeah, they're so cool. In at number two is my favourite ever Beanie Boo, it is Merlin. And what, I just love Merlin, he's so cool. I love his sort of black gothic style look. He looks kind of like a bad boy, but he's really cool. He's very magical looking, I guess that's why he's named Merlin after the wizard. He's got bright orange eyes, a bright orange belly and bright orange wings. And I just really love how the bright orange goes with the um, black, it's just super cute. And you got some kind of like shiny scales there, and I said he's my favorite beanie boo ever so that is why he is number two on our list and his tag reads i like to breathe fire right through my nose and when i do that you'll need a big nose now i always think that this is kind of a typo because i think it really should read i love to breathe fire through my nose and when i do that you'll need a big hose to put out the fire is what i would say it should say because i don't think you'll need a big nose really makes much sense but yeah anyway there we go that's merlin Number one is of course Darla and Darla is just so cute like she's actually my favorite Beanie Boo of all time and I just don't think she's possible to beat she's got such a sad look on her face which just makes her adorable and of course she's actually the first Beanie Boo that Tom gave me which is really sweet and just makes her so special to me Darla <laughs> and of course who could forget the mini clip Darla too T -t Darla the top 10 are they <laughs> what are you doing here you're not on this list darling oh, i'm not interested in you <laughs> you're not on this list darling i'm a good dancer oh look at that she can't. she thinks she's good at dancing darling you do make me chuckle then i'm the main event on this channel which is why i'm number one you guys all pick me as your number one right hey hey i'm the best beanie boo ever Darla, you're only ever going to be second best to me. Just you realise that, eh? I'm in Darla. <laughs> and I'm number one.